Here to TWA 137, turn left at Taxiway Alpha 5 and remain this frequency, and I will direct you to parking. Thank you, sir, TWA. There's a website, the spirit of TWA.com. See what's going on. Roger, thank you. I'm Fred Chandler, live here in Bullhead City. I'm the dad of Atlanta Chandler. And uh, sure wonderful to see this little plane land here. It's about the same thing that I had in San Diego in about 1943. So, uh, nice to see you here. Nice to see you. Come again. I've been hearing about Ford. I'm telling I'm just sick of it. Oh, she never I'm just sick of it. She's back to leave with a photograph later. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh let's see. Wow, yeah, we're really happy daddy. to be here. Yeah. In fact, I thought about the nice. coat. <laughs> I got off the plane with mine. I took it off fast. But that's because I'm really quick. You know, I get it really fast. Uh, ready? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to walk in. Yeah, okay. All right. No, don't dress the door. Hang on to the right. You might check everything out while you're in there. Yep, this is the same thing I had in San Diego. This is a beach craft. So you had one of these? Yeah, absolutely. This is a mine was made by uh, Beechcraft. Beechcraft. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful. I was in. I bought airplanes and fixed them and sold them. But if you were telling me, I understand that you push me pull. I heard all about the landing gear on that thing too. <laughs> yeah. I bought it all the way back in Palm Beach, Florida. No problem. My son and the flight instructor took it up the next day and couldn't get it. Thank you, Hannah. Then I like you. All of the system had a leak in the nose gear. I was simply kept throwing the wheel and kicks out. Finally, he caught the train. The so uh, uh, landing gear. And between the both of them, you know, once you get a certain point, it'll flop in. They got it to the point to where it flopped in and landed, no problem. He cut the front end, you know, so in case it knows, it's wouldn't get any of the pop. Well, that was a beautiful Here we are. We made it to Bullhead City, but I didn't think that was going to happen. So we're here, and we got a nice little turnout and a great welcome. Of course, there's some captain up there on this airplane. I had to do a little flyby and sort of show off the airplane. But uh, we're wrapping up the end of the tour. We've been coast to coast, back to New York with Jet Blue, and, and here we are in Bullhead City. Who would have thunk? <laughs> and this old guy, I'm going to him. Oh, my dad and, and the Virgin Black Cats is one of the Oh, Henry's Lord. And they did I like the same thing. I didn't Some like the hay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. But also, uh, they were air sheriffs. So they, they were the first air sheriff. Jack Fry, Paul Richter, and Walt Hammond. Yeah, it does. And, uh, it was 1927. And my dad had one situation where they called him and said that the criminal escaped. He's on the train to Mexico. Anyway, that's good. On the train to Mexico, and my dad just raced down there and, and stopped it with the plane. And the sheriff comes roaring. And it was a done deal, but my dad carried, you know, because he was a, a qualified air sheriff. That's what they call him. The biggest airplane I crashed was the DC-3. Yeah. On a movie called... Uh, and on purpose. 